If you want to trade your Apex Futures account using TradingView, here's how you do it. First things first, you have to have an Apex account, obviously. So head over to the Apex site and buy one of those. Once you've purchased an Apex account, you'll be able to trade on TraderVate. This is my setup on TraderVate. I have two screens here, one for the one hour and one for the 15 minute with the daily levels and H1 levels on there. And I just trade between the zones, but it doesn't matter what your setup is. The goal here is to show how to connect this TraderVate account from Apex onto your TradingView chart. So let's have a look how to do that. First thing we want to do is activate TradingView on the TraderVate account here. So come on over to the settings up here in the top right, click on those. This is your risk management section, but that's a whole nother video. So we'll go through that another day. This is my settings on a 50K account. As you can see, I've got a daily loss limit of $1,000, weekly loss, three and a half thousand, weekly profit target, three and a half thousand. So the part we want is over here with the add-ons. So click on the add-ons here and see where it says TradingView. We need to activate this to give us access on TradingView to our TraderVate account, which is running our Apex challenge. So simply activate this, simple as that. It's an important step. If you don't do this first, you won't be able to connect your trading view to your Apex account through TraderVate. So once we've done that, we don't need to worry about these other options. That's it. Simple as, we'll just close that. We're back on our charts. Job done. Now we're going to head over to trading view and connect this account. So now on to trading view here. As you can see, we're just on a standard chart on GU, on CFDs. So we need to make sure we're on a CME chart. So for example, head over to NQ on the CME. You want to select that by typing in NQ over here. Make sure you're on Futures CME. It's now on Trading View on the Futures chart, CME. Before you connect, you'll find your CME data is running 15 minutes behind unless you pay for the CME data separately from Trading View, which I do. It's less than $10 a month, so worth doing. But we should get live data once we connect our Apex account anyway. So come down to the bottom here and click on the arrow. As you can see, you have various brokers you can connect to. The one we want is TradeVate. If yours isn't at the top here, just scroll down. It will be there somewhere. So we're going to click on TradeVate now. Then you need to log in with your Apex TradeVate account details. So we're over on our Apex account here, just on the dashboard. You can see you've got the username and password. So just copy those across. So those are entered now. So we're just going to click Connect. So fingers crossed, we should now be connected to our Apex account through TradeVate on TradingView. And if you can see here, we are on TradeVate Apex. It's my account balance. It is just a challenge account, so we're quite close to passing that. 53,000, I think, is the target. And that's it. You've done it. You are now connected to your TradeVate on TradingView. And you can just trade that account on TradingView. There's a couple of ways you can trade your new connected account now on TradingView. Simply click on Trade down here and it will open your trading panel. So you can either buy or sell. So if we're buying here, we're going to use the stop buy. I'm going to pull our stop below and I'll take profit above. And our entry point above because we're using a stop order. And then the number of contracts we wish to risk. Here we've got one contract. So you can see we'd be risking $800 on that for a profit 865. And we're on the five minute chart here. As you can see, it's updating in real time as well. It's not a 15 minute delay. The way you might want to place trades, seeing as we're using TradingView anyway, is with this great tool where you just place your trading positions like this. Right click on there, click create order, and it will set the stop loss and take profit and entry points for for you make sure you set these because it won't do this part for you so again we want to stop limit order here if you're just going for limit buy you might think you're entering there but it won't it'll enter you there because it's a lower price so you want to stop limit here set the number of contracts you wish to trade we're just going to stick with one you can see the risk from there to there it's worked it all out for you 495 dollars risk 880 dollars profit and it's as simple as that once you set up, you just click the buy button there and it'll place that order. So you've got two ways to set orders there on TradingView using your TraderVate account from Apex, which is now connected. And that's it. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time. Bye bye.